Hello everyone and welcome back to Everyday Husband Quotes, the channel for marriage advice, marriage entertainment, and everything else, marriage. Hey, hey guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. Now let's talk about Melody Hope from Love and Marriage Huntsville. I did read a few comments online that said Melody doesn't practice what she preaches and that statement is coming from the argument that she had with Miss Wanda on Love and Marriage Huntsville at Destiny's relaunch for Madani. Now, I don't know if I find this comment to be laughable or what because it seems like some people, for one, have put Melody on a pedestal or two, people are trying to call her out as being fake because let's just call it like it is, honey. When referencing that comment that she is not practicing what she is preaching, that's almost saying like a person is being fake. They are not real or they just say what they think people want to hear to make themselves look good. I mean, that's just what I get from that comment. I don't agree with that comment. Personally, I do feel like Melody's life is a living testimony, but ain't nothing, honey. For me, come hell or hot water, they can make me put a person on a pedestal like they can't do anything wrong. And when they do let you down, because people will let you down, you're mad because that person disappointed your expectations of what you had for them. And so I also want to talk about the different messages that Melody has on like her personal social media accounts. And the messages that she shows there is all about healing. She is all about healing and, and self-care and going to therapy. She wants a woman to tap into that part of knowing her self-worth. She's very positive and she is a God-fearing woman. And y'all, this is not something that I am assuming, but Melody literally creates these type of posts on her social media account to say that this is who she is. So in this video that I'm about to play for you all, she does defend herself. And I don't even want to say defend. I think she has an aha moment about why did that side come out of her and why it was easy for her to react in that moment like she did with Miss Wanda. And it goes back to her family roots. And I really think that that is a real and I'll authentic statement from Melody because sometimes we can be like with our children oh he has mannerisms like his dad or on this side of the family we're not like that but when it comes to his mom's side everybody is that way but I also feel like certain situations can pull certain things out of you and in this case Miss Wanda was talking about Melody's daughter and so before I show this video I still don't agree with Melody showing up to Destiny's relaunch uninvited for Madani. I know that's a very unpopular opinion, but I also feel like Melody could have handled that situation with Miss Wanda in a different environment, not at the girls' relaunch. But I do understand it was a moment for TV, honey. So y'all take a listen. Leave your thoughts in the comment section of this video. As always, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Hi, Mel. I'm proud of you. Oh, thank you so much. You know, I am on a, I'm on a journey that is ever um, lasting and I'm ever evolving, okay? <laughs> I am not perfect. I ain't never made it seem like I was perfect. Um, I'm just me. And fortunately, um, more days than not, I am positive and a good me and um, choose the side of light. Okay? Um, Melody, better stop playing with you. When it comes to your baby, you're not going to play. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. I, um... I was literally having a conversation um, with my family and I have learned some things about my family and what well, I will say reminded of is what I will say reminded of some things pertaining to my family and because um, I was a kid but I remember um, <laughs> anybody from like Pike County where I'm from I remember hearing about this when I was younger but I guess I had kind of forgotten about it but I was asking, I'm like, y'all, I don't know where, like, this side of me that's in me sometimes, I don't know where it comes from. I was like, I don't know. Like, I said, you know, looking back at it growing up, people didn't bother me, so I ain't have to fight people. I ain't have to get into it with people. Like, I just wasn't that. I wasn't confrontational, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, I don't know why I got this side where well, I'd be ready for whatever. I don't know. And so I was talking to like some of my great aunts and stuff and I was reminded how my grandfather and them, 
used to drive all across over to Barber County, the neighboring county, and they knew when they dropped down over there, it was about to be hell. But I was a kid, but I remember people talking about it since they reminded me. I was like, dang, that's right. <laughs> I was like, it's in my blood. Because I've been wondering, now, Mel, what is, where, why? And, and let me just say this. You know, this situation in the first situation where I um, have seen this side of me, <laughs> but... I really didn't know where it came from. And so uh, now I know it's just in the woods. Um, because my grandfather and my uncles and them, I ain't going to lie. I rem they reminded me they they used to be off the chain for real. People used to be scared of them. And I forgot. <laughs> I really forgot. I'm like, that's where it came from. It's in the blood. God dang. But, you know, it's all good. More than not, like I said, I choose to be positive and love on people and be nice to people, be kind to people, um, help people, pour into people. That's what I really love to do. So, you know. <sighs> um, yeah. Mel, you said you go low. I'm going to go to hell. <laughs> y'all, I've been seeing that in my DM so much. Y'all have been um, running with that. <laughs> y'all so funny. I'm like, you Mel, I don't mess with nobody unless you keep messing with me. Yeah, and it takes a lot. Um, it takes a lot for me to get to that point. You know what I'm saying? For sure. It does. Like, you, you can offend me a few times before I get to that point. I don't do that. You know? I don't do that tell you something sometimes the enemy will trick folks and make them think they win make them think that it's prospering okay let me tell you something baby god always has the last say so that's, and that's it. real Th that that spirit they throwing is gonna be our boomerang that's right that's right yes and then a comeback full circle no weapon Formed against Melody Sheree. Hey. Will ever prosper. They'll try to throw the hand. They'll try to throw the rock and hide the hand, but it won't work. Yes. <laughs> Come on now. You gotta personalize it. Yes, God. All right. Yes. No. Nah, That's but... listen. That's my song because God will do. Go ahead. He said he would. He's not a man that he should lie. He will come through. But he said he's going to do it. Go this. for it. Stand by his word. Hey, he will come through. No weapon formed against me come on. shall prosper. No. It won't work. Yes, you know, I... BJ, my boo, my choir singing you know, boo. You so silly. You know I love you for life. I love you back. Are you gonna be down this weekend? Let me tell you, God is amazing. I wake up every day, you know, um, for the most part, every day, feeling good. Um, you know, I mind my business. I worry about my business. You mind the business that pays you. Yes, I do. When it comes to reciprocation and feeling like what you're giving out is being returned unto you. That's why you have to be so careful about who you allow in your space and who you allow in your energy. Come on. Um, I literally, um, <laughs> when I tell you, PJ, I, I don't really talk to nobody. Um, and someone asked me today when I was telling them that they said, but why? Because I was like, I just love to be in my house by myself. I don't want to go to the store for groceries. I ain't going to do, deliver that stuff to my door. I don't want to. I said, I wish they could deliver gas to my door. OK, I don't want to go nowhere for real. And yeah. they said, but why? And I said, because I'm just, that's just the space that God has me in right now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot that I've been through. There's a lot that I've seen. There's a lot that has been re been revealed, you know. And for this season right now of my life, God has me separate. And that's, that's just it. what it is. It don't matter who like it, who don't like it. 
who it don't care if it seems like it shouldn't be that way. I ain't have I ain't in no depression, I ain't having no mental breakdown. But Come right on. now, I'm just Come on. me by myself. That, that's that's it. it. And, and it's I the... can't, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, let me tell you something. It feels amazing, though. It's There's a whole new level of peace. There's a whole new level of drama free. That's it. It's just, um, it's wonderful. Can't nobody say Melody said nothing because Melody don't even talk to nobody. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let me tell you something. I just changed my number and I see my makeup artist Jay is on here. I just changed my number last night. It's about six people that got my number. That's it. About six. That's good. About six. That's it. Um, and it, you just get to a place sometimes where you just need to be you and God and that's it. You know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. Jay already know, like I saw him on here, um, mm -hmm. but he, he works with me a lot, you know, because hey, Jay. he does my makeup. <laughs> he does makeup, so he already knows, like, I literally be in my space, in my business, and it has been amazing. And this is new for me, I'll be real with you, because mm -hmm. I am, all my life, I've been around people. All my life, I've been, you know, at church, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, then, you know, school stuff, president, about five organizations, in the band, cheerleader, basketball, volleyball. So I was always, you know, doing stuff, right? And so I'm used to being around people and I love people. I love people. However, this new feeling in this time when God has me alone, man, it feels good. It feels, it feels good. Amazing.